if i ask you a question in how many ways a microservice can positively respond to your api calls what answer are you going to give me let's take a hypothetical scenario wherein the client makes a call to the microservice the microservice writes its information into your database and the resource gets created on the db now there are multiple calls which are being made on these resource get put post delete which can be made and let's see how this microservice responds to these calls the first one is 200 ok where in in the api call the server it spawned back to the response body which is equivalent to the data being stored on the server of that resource being requested the api call supported usually are get and post the standard success response with body and payload the next one is 201 created these identify that a new resource will be created on the server the api call supported are post and put the next one is 202 accepted this is used in heavy lifting apis wherein the server will take time to process the request the server accepts the request and returns back a job id job url is, is must in these api calls the client further makes a call on those job urls to get the actual status of that job and it is done for background processing slash webhooks the next one is 204 no content that means the server has accepted your request and is not responding back with any payload 204 no content the server will execute the api call and will not respond back with anything usually delete and put are used in such methodology